Hey guys, Park out the Dark here and bring you some more Let's Play Bully Scholarship Edition. Uh, so yeah, we're back here and I think we should change our clothes if we can. I don't know where that is. Oh, there it is. Okay. Uh, can we just get the outfit? Halloween costume, pajamas, fast food, red ninja, nutcracker, elf outfit, custom outfit. It's cool uniform. Yeah, let's just go for that. There we go. Alright, now we're back to it. So, where are we headed off to? Let's see, there's a star right in town. It's kind of weird. You know what I'm gonna do it though. Let's get this mission going before the school starts. Go, 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 go. Listen, pal, help me out. More jobs here. Why am I being chased? I didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, I'm... Oh, here again? Are you serious? Oh, they almost caught me. Okay, we gotta use the stairs. Wait, where is this? Ah, oh, god damn it. Wait, no, we can't go this way. Where is it then? Oh, it's this way. Of course, I knew that. <laughs> Mr. Big! Yeah, it was you, creep! What was me? Don't play innocent with us! I tried that when Father caught me with Nanny. He gave me a good thrashing, and I've got half a mind to give you one! Hey, look, just get to the point. Someone stole our boxing trophies, buddy! They were heirlooms! Well, it wasn't me, rich boy, so relax. Well, if it wasn't you, then who was it? I bet it was those grease balls. I know it, they've always hated us. And so much for peace in our time, Popper. Just great. Let's get them. Yes, it's time to teach those poor, disrespectful scum a lesson. Wait, relax. Maybe it wasn't them. Maybe it was someone else. Nobody hates us, apart from them. Oh yeah, they do. Everyone hates you. You're all awful. Oh, la-dee-da, now he tells us. You are pathetic, Hopkins. You're not a leader. Out of my way! Come on, men! Let's go! Okay. It's war! Hold on! Wait here. I'll go get your trophy back from those grease balls. Oh, man. Get back to school, kid. Is it not painfully obvious that it's not they're doing but uh gary's like it to me it's so obvious okay i could go either go that way uh, so you know i've already made it all the way down here you know i think it's the same distance so it doesn't really matter i just wish i had a bike and yes i know i can go to class but i'm in the middle of a mission i really wish i had a bike right about now why is there no any bikes here? This would be a good spot. <clears throat> trying to catch that car, it's, it's picking up speed. Yeah, it doesn't seem like I'll be able to. Where's this place again? Alright. So not here, but... Oh god damn it! This way. We're almost done. Okay, so we're going over here. But yeah, it's so painfully obvious to me that Gary is behind all this. There's a bike. I'm not gonna use it though, because screw it. We're almost here anyway. Here we are. All right, Vance. Did you guys steal the preppy's trophies? No way, man. After the townie's been saying all that stuff about Lola and made Johnny crazy, we don't care about those stuck-up jerks. The townies? Really? 
Yeah, and Johnny says you're no friend of ours anymore. But since you got him out, I'll let you walk away from this meeting. Well, since I already beat you, I guess I believe you. If I knew how to paint, I would paint something real. Oh, the townies are getting on my nerves. And I now I, I want that bike. Where is it again? Yeah, that... Uh, traveling between location to location is getting to the point where it's a uh, pain in the butt. I guess it was always a pain in the butt. For me, I just want to be teleported there. <laughs> no hassle. No. You see, I don't mind this... Uh, going to places when it's in games like GTA because you can just hop on a car so it doesn't even have to be your car but here it's like <laughs> did that old grandma just jump out of the way but here it's like where are you gonna find a bike they're not very uh, easy to come by where's this place is it here <clears throat> all right Get a picture. Oh, whoa, whoa, what? I'm really not liking this part. Get in there, you little sucker! Ow! <laughs> Better hope you don't get rabies. I see. Just imagine the look on their face when they get another crate of rats. Nope, that's not what I want to do. <laughs> All the little nerds running around screaming like girls. <laughs> Good photo, go. All right, hurry up. Can't be late for the party at the docks. Travel to the docks. Oh, easy. Wait, how are we getting this mission? We're doing something else completely. No, stop. Docks. Why are we going to the docks now? All right, here we go. Tab, maybe. Yeah. Okay. We're just following them. Grab the tannies with the stolen trophies. Oh, there we go. Is this a good enough spot to take the picture from? Nope. Not good enough. That's a good photo. There we go. Return to the boxing game. Alright, so overall, this isn't a bad mission. I think. I just need to get back. Well, Popper, what did you find? Yeah, who took our trophies? Don't tell me. It was the Tooth Fairy. <laughs> yeah, either it was the Tooth Fairy or the Grease Balls. I wonder which one. Actually, trust fund babies. It was neither. It was those townies. Which townies? The ones who hang out by the factory. Them? Why would they steal our trophies? Don't talk crap, Hopkins. I'm not. I've got a picture to prove it. Why? They don't have any problems with us. Yeah, poor kids just love rich kids who act like stuck-up jerks, don't they? 
Listen, you over-fortunate numbskull. They did everything. Put Johnny Vincent in the home, let the rats out of the library, everything, including your trophies. Why? Because I listened to Gary. So it is your fault. No, it was Gary's fault. You, my friend, have got delusions of grandeur. Nobody cares about you or Gary. You're ridiculous. Come on, Biff. Let's leave this king of this school to his pathetic little fantasies. You are an idiot, Hopkins. I've got a photograph. You know what you can do with that, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sh I'm not sure if they believe me or either way I'm gonna go to school now and attend class because I don't think we're doing much of that. I don't know how much time we have either. Uh plus there's no other missions besides that. So yeah, let's go uh, let's go to class. I might skip that just to make the video shorter. So you don't see my failures, I don't. Where are these freaking stairs? There's one upstairs. Mission upstairs here. Huh. This can't be good. Jimmy! You've interrupted me. Oh, sorry. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Can I see? Sure. Take a look. I think I have finally caught the essence of what it means to be a banana. I really feel my work is moving forward. Uh, here's the thing. Art is lost on me. I've always been more into music. You know? Having thoughts for another really makes your work glow. Uh, how do you mean? When people do things, incredible things, when people blossom and grow, that really moves me. You know what I mean? Not really. <laughs> I am in love, Jimmy. And I want to make tonight very special. Would you mind going to collect a few things while I work my muse out? A dress, some perfume, my pearl necklace from the jewelers, not too much. I must look my best tonight. Tonight? Wow, of course. Is this legal? Of course it's legal. Whatever can you mean? Now go on, my dear. Hurry! What's going on? I'm kind of scared. Oh, we're being timed? Good. So I wouldn't want to uh, get any other way. Oh my god. Alright, so first things... I guess we'll get those ones because they're close together first. Guy from class? Is he like following me? Berry. Let me know if you like now. assistance at all. Okay. I wonder. If I double the payment, would my mark go up? There we go. Yeah, they're like following me. Oh, you got caught by the cops. What the hell is going on? Slide on in. I 
was just looking for one of those. I'm scared. What what is happening? Why is Let's there commotion? What the hell is going on? Okay, let's go to the other town. Dude, I want to try that. Oh, no. Let's go to town. We don't got a lot of time left. I don't know what's going on. Why? Who that guy is? Or why he's chasing me? I want to be around to find out. I want to piss off the cops. Come on, come on, go, 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 go. Just a race against time right now. What the hell? This... Ah! Oh. <laughs> okay, where? Here. Got my eye on you. Another one for the collection. A red dress. Here we go. There's the light. Again? What is going on? Did something happen? Why is everyone after me? God damn it, Gary. Teacher, and then we're done. Can't be done fast enough. Here you go. Oh, Jimmy, what took you so long? Thanks. No problem. Oh, man, I can't believe this. My first time with a teacher. Oh, man, this is gonna be great. Hey, Jimmy, what are you doing here? Nothing. What are you doing here? Ah, uh, well, it's a little awkward, but since you've been such a good friend to me, Ms. Phillips, she's asked me, me, of all people, she, can you believe? She's asked me on a date. Wait, she asked you? I think you're mistaken. Uh, what? Yeah, I mean, I think there's been some sort of mistake. You sure you haven't been hitting the bottle again? No. I mean, yes, I am sure. Well, okay then. Hitting the bottle. <sighs> Lionel, you came. You look great. So do you, Deirdre. Thank you. Wait, what? Jimmy, what are you still doing here? Uh, what do you mean? This boy is an angel. He's been magnificent. Uh-huh. And he is so cute. Cute. <laughs> nice. Come on, Lionel. Let's go. Bye, Jimmy. Jimmy, you should get back to school. Wait, Miss Phillips. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> what the fuck? This game is messed up. Oh my god. I'm going, I'm going. Where is class anyway? Oh my god. What is it? Art. Okay, I in can do this. In this assignment, I'd like you to pay particular attention to the emotions you experience and try to get them onto the page. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh wow. Oh, that was impossible. What was he supposed to do? Oh no, whoops. I messed that up. Big time. Oh, oh god. Oh 
Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Almost done. Gotta get that hand. Come on, come on. Get over here. Are you serious, man? What? Oh, I got it. Okay. There we go. That's an excellent chimney. Mind if I? That's how you do it. Uh huh. Ain't no stopping Jimmy Hopkins. Come on, help me out here. No. This is what I think of you. All right. I always knew you were a failure. Oh, principal. You know what? Let's do it. Ah, Hopkins. Now, I'm not one to give in to popular sentiment. You can tell that by your clothes. What? I'm saying you dress great. Irrelevant. As I said, I am not a people pleaser, but in your case, I'm going to make an exception. An exception? Cool. Yes, you are without a doubt the least popular boy in this school right now. Even that fat child who wets himself is more popular than you. Coincidentally, it has also come to my attention that you are a filthy, dirty, foul-mouthed, awful little vandal. Yeah, well, we already knew that. Very droll. A comedian till the end. Well, you'll have to pursue your comedic talents elsewhere, boy. Bullworth is not for you. I'm not the one who's funny. You know what's funny? You. You're a joke, you old creep. You and your stuck-up, lame-ass school with its bullies and sex-pest teachers. This place is a dump, and you're a big-nosed freak. This school rewards losers and bullies. I just stand up to them. You painted obscene graffiti on the town hall, boy. I have it on good authority it was you. Oh, yeah? Then who squealed? Tell me that. A commendable pupil did feel the need to tell me you were responsible for this outrage. Gary Smith! Look, I may have painted a few jokes on the town hall, but that kid likes to torture people. Gary Smith is the next head of this school. He's responsible, courteous, and not afraid of being an unpopular leader. You are blind, old man, blind! And you are leaving! I tried to contact your mother, but she's still off on a cruise. Until I hear from her, I will have to let you stay here in your room. But you may not wear the school uniform uh, or attend classes. Gotta be kidding you are me. leaving the academy to attend to your education elsewhere. Now get out! Whatever, man. Wow. Alright, well, that's a pretty good spot to end it, I guess. Um, but if you guys enjoyed this episode, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you haven't, and as always, I shall catch you on the next episode of Let's Play Bully Scholarship Edition. Take care for now, and I shall see you guys next time. Later!